this is part 21 of angular 14 series and in this session we'll discuss about that angular material table sorting how do we enable that and uh, you know in this you know example we'll consider that you know client side sortings okay so in the next session maybe we'll discuss about that server rendering as well okay now let's get into the code so earlier uh, session i discussed already how to render the data and to display inside this uh, you know uh, grid now today we'll discuss about that sorting now go to the ngmat module first now to enable the sorting you just go to the angular material website and here as yes, so sorting you know, sort header as well you can see now just uh, go to the api so mat sort module you need to you know import so here mat sort module we just add, add this now let's save it now go to the you know grid component html and uh, if i go to the basic you know usage of the sorting first we need to use this you know directive to enable the sort let me add it here and next change is to you know you have to add this part mat sort header uh, you know, directive here this one now next thing is just go to the ts file over here and here you can see you know some sort of code but i will do it some uh, simple way that is just go to the you know, with a grid component here and inside this ng on changes what i'll do first i will check this changes object is having this row list and then a uh, current value is if it is there then i will check the length if that is exist i mean valid row list so this ng on changes actually fires two times when you pass data from parent to child okay first uh, time it was you know undefined next time actually it will come with the original value so once uh, it will you know come with the original you know actual value that that time only actually i am just going to add the you know apply the sorting okay so for that what you need to do variable that is called empty data source empty means material table and here uh, mat table data source only class is there and i'm pass i will pass here maybe any type i will assign the value you know empty data source equal to new mat table this actually class will help you to you know use that client side sorting or pagination you know all the things okay so this is only for just to keep in mind only for uh, the client side you know purpose only if you want to you know move this functionality uh, with the server side you know pagination or maybe sorting then for that scenario this is not required so i will show you the next step okay in next uh, session now here uh empty data source dot you know sort already is the sort uh, you know property and here i will use one more you know sorry uh, view child and here i will pass mat sort okay and uh, maybe first time i don't want to assign any value uh, that's what actually i kept this uh, not symbol and actually i'm telling to typescript i don't want to you know assign initial value in this you know property okay now here in this uh, scenario is uh, so a uh, t sort i just will apply this one so this mat sort actually uh, it it will take the reference from this you know sorting you know table from this directive where is that yeah mat sort this directive and this will have the reference of this table sorting in you know, a state so here it will apply 
okay just let's save this change and go to the browser so now if i hover on this you know header see the icon is showing that means sort already is applied okay now if i click on this see something is not happening here right so to you know that icon is changing but value is not sorting out so for that what you need to do just go to this table and here go to the examples and if i go here now just uh, so this mat sort change method already is there okay now go to here what we need to do we need to pass on custom you know method here you know sort column and then you need to pass that event to get that column state sort state now let's so here uh you know sort okay just this, you know add this interface here and just copy this code uh first of all let to check is what is sort dot you know direction if the direction is there i mean ascending or descending then only i will apply this you know sorting okay just save this change go to the browser now see okay it should work something is not there it is not working let me verify it it's because of this you know empty data source is not having any value what we need to do you know here we need to you know convert the array with this mat you know data source okay new mat table data source uh, here it is asking the initial data here for our case row list i will pass it you know just save this so we need to pass this mat table you know mat data source here so that it can you know it will get to know or uh, now the definition of the sorting and other things also just to go to the browser now now see it is working as expected right now so every column actually is getting you know, sorted now customer name is also working but here you can see this total word is you know total order is not working as because where is that mobile number and order see, this order column definition and that this property of this you know array is not you know same so that is why actually it is not able to in a sort uh, by the angular material table if i go to the customer component ts file here and this one also i make it as order so now let's save this change and now see now it is working okay so just keep in mind whatever you know columns you know you know array properties are uh, you know coming from api those column property okay that column property name and that display column name should be you know same otherwise it won't able to you know apply this client side sorting okay for server side sorting you can you know have you know more control on this and next uh, session we'll discuss about that pagination okay and uh, this is client side uh, you know, sorting and uh, for server side sorting uh, we'll discuss in another you know, session so for that uh, stay tuned and be safe thank you for listening have a great day